Hello friends, I am Ranjit Jha and you are watching Technology Expert and today I come with my new topic, Volume. How to understand the volume in the CM market and number of users ask me sir please explain volume or make a video on the volume the short way so we understand how volume behave. Actually how the price go up and down that information giving the indicator but indicator also take the help from the volume. So everything in the depend on the volume so if you understand the volume then you understand the market. You understand the authentication of the indicator either it's a MSCD or either it's a RCA or any RSI or any other indicator you get information about one everything so everything I'm going to uh, cover here but before that if you are new do like subscribe and press the bell icon so you will get immediately notification whenever I upload the new topic so first try to understand what is volume the total number of share buy and sell between the uh, users that is called a trading volume of a share. For example, user A buy 100 share and user sell, sell 100 share. It means what? Total number of shares exchange between A and B is 100. Mostly users are confused here. They consider the B having, uh, B bought the 100 share and A sell the 100 share. So total count is 200, but no. It's a 100, but 100 share exchange between the two people. Or in the similarly, thousands of share exchange between the n number of people. Sometimes buyers are more, sometimes sellers are more. Okay, so the total count is known as the volume, and the volume will always decide the direction of your share. It will go up direction or it will go down direction. Now I categorize the volume section in the four way that help you to understand the share price will go up or price will go down. As well as I cover here the few things that capture the wrong information like a bluff. Some the market is playing with us sometimes. We think like that we are playing with the market but the practical uh, but reality is market is playing with us. So we need to understand the sentiment of market here. So I categorize the volume in the four way but before that you should know how to apply the volume. So I am showing the example of the Jeroda. Whatever trading platform you are using everywhere it's available. So no need to worry for that. You can directly go and apply there. You have to explore that tool. Yeah. So now Jaroda tool, you just need to go to Jaroda page. So that's why I give the topic how to apply the volume in the chart. So how to apply the volume in the chart. For that purpose, you have to go to the study. Just click on the study button. After that, just type the volume chart here. Once you type the volume chart, the new window will appear. Inside that window, two options, up volume and down volume, where the green indicate the direction of up volume and the red indicate direction of down volume so it's all up to you not necessary always use this color you can go with the default or either you can select any other color as for your comfort i prefer to go with the default one once you click on the done so automatically the volume will apply at the your trading publication page so here you can see it's a realize page where i saw the realize market of the 8th of april now below that the volume is applied okay here you can see 10, 10, 30, 11, 11, different time zone you can see the volume, volume is going up and volume is going down. Now I will explain how volume behaves. So you just need to remember only four points. If you remember these four points, I bet you, you never lost your money in the market. But you have to remember those points. One by one I am going to explain those things. The first important point is the when the price having the uptrend and the volume in the downtrend. So you have to avoid the sell. Price in the downtrend, volume in the uptrend. Third is the price uptrend and volume downtrend. Fourth is the price downtrend and volume downtrend. Both are done. Means the first price and volume up. Second, price down, volume down. Third, price up, volume down. Fourth, price down and volume up. You have to just remember these four points. Now I'm going to explain one by one in the chart so that helpful that helps you to understand. So first example. Here you can see price in uptrend and volume also in the uptrend. So you can see here the volume is going up direction. The n number of green candles are forming here, or the price is also in the up direction. So when you saw such behavior, then you have to understand it will go more up. First thing you have to find the entry point. How you can find the entry point? You need to understand the MSCD. If you don't know MSCD, no need to worry. I'm giving the link in the description. You can go and watch the video. Or you need to understand the RSI. If you don't know, again I am missing the link there. Apart from all the things, you should know the candle analysis. If you don't know about the candle pattern, the video is available in Hindi and English both. Whatever you are comfortable, go and watch that video so you understand. So once you find the entry point, once you find the entry point, so now volume is going up. So it's a clear index and the indicator, the potential direction is also up. So market in the bullish trend. So price will go up. So you have to wait. You didn't go for sale. You have to wait. 
it will go more up after that you need to find the point or then go for the exit for example you bought somewhere this place at the 100 rupee or after it's going 110 150 160 170 or you think oh the red candle is forming so i need to quit not like that you have to find the point or how you find you have to understand the candle if you understand then you can wait because the volume is going up so here you can see the more uh, green candle is forming it clear indication uh, it's a very strong uh, uh, strong uh, potential so it will go more up so you have to wait some time till that time your share doesn't give the indication of negative trend or reversal of the trend in that way you can book a good profit so if the price is a downtrend plus volume in the downtrend first we saw the price was in uptrend and the volume was also in the uptrend now both are in the downtrend look at me the, the price is also going downtrend the volume is also going on downtrend in this case also it's a direction that giving the potential of the share is high the chances it will go up so don't be worried if you saw such kind of chart both are going down so it doesn't means uh, it's uh, uh, it's showing the negative thing you can go for the sell there short term selling and you will get a good benefit here now here volume is the down and the price is going up so it's like a bluff is playing market is playing with you when you saw that the volume is down price is going up or you assume it will go more up more up more up or I will get more benefit that doesn't happen after I think at certain point market will fall down at any point and you will lose all your capital on that case what you have to do you have to find a exit point and you need to exit immediately from there if you wait it will go up 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 the 99 percent chance you will lose your capital because it's a, like a bluff volume is a different direction price in a different direction so it's not giving the clear indication it's giving a clear indication it's a wrong uh, uh, wrong way of market potential is very down okay uh, now sellers are uh, more powerful instead of buyers so price will go down anytime so you have to quit from the market so you can protect your capital or save your capital. price is downtrend plus volume in the uptrend now volume is going up and price in the downtrend so in this case when volume is up and price is down again it's a showing the potential in the down okay potential is down so you have to you, uh, you, you will go for the sell instead of buy you go for the sell uh, select the short term, uh, short term sell, look at the entry point, find the exit point and go for the sell instead of waiting that market will take the reverse trend. Market will not take reverse from here, it will go down, 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 down. So you have to remember that you want to price in downtrend or volume in the uptrend. Now what you have to do? You can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Insta and LinkedIn. Go anywhere just type the magic B2W and you will get the profile of engineer Ranjit Jha. So you can follow or follow me there and ask the question whatever question comes in your mind related to the share market the trading either it's intraday trading short term uh, uh, trading uh, how to apply the bracket order how to apply the amo after market order whatever question comes in your mind or if you want to see any other technical analysis uh, write down in the question section or you can write in the comment section also i will try to take all the question and answer here now if you want to appreciate me, please share this video with the other and don't forget to click on subscribe and press the bell icon.